So it's one thing uh, when you're in this business a long time, you find it hard to give up your old paid for wreckers. I'll take you into my private special parts shed that I keep parts for wreckers, some going back as far as the early 1900s. Ring gears, bearings, bushings. These are factory homes handles. There's a lot of really rare stuff in here. That's Ernest Holmes right there. So those kind of things, parts and pieces for every old wrecker around. These are old shiv ends for trucks where they go back together parts, you know, where they would lock together the booms. All kinds of original stuff that still have the tags on them. It's a boom lock. I probably have one of the biggest parts collections for old wreckers than most people would ever have. I'm thinking this is a Holmes 500 ring gear. Al Quarry would love to get his hands on that, but they're mine. Kevin smashed it up one more time. I got a spare mirror. I got two spare mirrors for it. I have everything. Booms, shiv ends. Here's a Holmes 500 boom. This is an 850 shiv head right here. Right there, that's an 850. I have original Holmes mud flaps. This is a, it's, it's one of the most desired ones right here. Or the original one with the hook on it. I think I hoard this stuff is what I do. I, I collect it, hoard it. And then uh, I think I have a, a phobia that if something breaks down, I won't have everything I need. They all give me a hard time about my antique roadshow, but at the end of the day, I know that no matter what, I'll be in business because I can always activate my old trucks, take them out of the rhubarb, paint them up, put some parts on them, and I'll be in business no matter what. If this company went broke tomorrow, I would rise from the ashes like a phoenix. So I'll give you a little sneak peek of what we're doing in the shop right now. This is a Home 750. So what we've done with this truck is we've put new checker plate on the deck, new sides formed up for it, welded the old school round beacon mounts on it, which are really cool. We put a new crane on here, changed the booms. It has a roll down back window, it has air conditioning, two high back bucket seats. And this is what that truck looked like in 1985. We're gonna paint this truck our colors, red and white, but we're gonna keep the gold and the white stripes that are on it and it'll look just gorgeous. It'll look like a truck that just came out of a truck show. When you see this thing when it's done, it's gonna blow your mind. If anything gives up on this truck or anything breaks down, you can either take it to the machine shop and fix it or I have the part in my backyard here. So when things really get tough like they are here in Hope, we're gonna bring out the secret weapons and these are my secret weapons for next season. Highway Through Hell, Sundays at 10 on the Weather Channel.